competition in the form of number three, Arwen Court in the beating heart of Sandhurst. To all of our bidders and buyers, make sure to bid bold, bid aggressively. Bid to the absolute upper echelon of your capacity and give yourself every opportunity to be that lucky and successful buyer at the end of today. I'm sure you are somewhere in the crowd. So to you, a slightly early congratulations is in order for your wonderful purchase. And what a wonderful purchase it will be for you for the many many years to come. I'd like to take this time to thank our vendors very, very much for not only entrusting myself to be the auctioneer, but also the entire selling team at Coco Mar Real Estate for selling what is arguably their most prized possession. Now, of course, your listing agent is none other than the best in suburb and arguably one of the top agents in all of Victoria, Coco Mar herself, supported by the rest of the team. Now, I am going to be calling them out as I see them in the crowd. We've got Javid here, Selena, Hong, William, all there to support you with any questions that you may have about the property or also support you with your bidding endeavors too. Now, I will let you know that the auction is conducted in accordance with the rules and any additional conditions made available for inspection before the start of the auction. The auction rules prohibit the auctioneer from accepting bids or offers for a property after the property has been knocked down to the successful bidder. The rules do permit vendor bids. The words I will be using to indicate I am placing a bid on behalf of our vendors is simply vendor bid. By law, only I as the auctioneer can place those vendor bids. Now, of course, uh, our vendors have a reserved price. As your auctioneer, I will be indicating bidders on request. The law prohibits false bids, prohibits major disruptions by bidders, and prohibits bidders from attempting to prevent others from bidding. And it will issue fines for misconduct. The settlement terms for the purchase of this home, in the words of our vendors, the sooner the better 30 to 60 days is preferred. If you are the lucky and successful buyer, a standard 10% deposit will be asked of you of the full purchase price. And that's to be made available to the trust account of Coco Ma Real Estate by bank check or bank transfer. Buyers, that's the boring stuff out the way. Let's talk about the beautiful property up for your competition here today. Three, Arwen Court in Sandhurst. None other than Sandhurst itself. This nestled away in the Sandara Estate, a premium estate in the area. You're going to have access to all of the local amenities here. Beautiful place here to be living. And just have a look at the neighborhood. So family friendly. The neighbors are all friendly faces as well. And you will fit exactly right in. Perfect place to raise your family um, and all kinds of buyers here. You're going to well, uh, the, the thing that I absolutely love about Sandhurst, that is, it is absolutely smack bang in the middle of everything that Melbourne has to offer from the CBD, the Bayside, and also the mountain ranges as well. You're going to have access to everything that Melbourne has on offer and everything that people love about Melbourne. You're going to have that and much, much more. You've got the parks, playgrounds, walking trails, schools, public, private, primary and secondary. You've got Bunyan Fields Primary School, Caram Down Secondary College, 10 minutes literally down the road to the beach the shops down in Patterson Lakes and much, much more public transport accessibilities and freeways like the East Link to take you in and out of the CBD. It's such a great place to live. And the house, don't get me started on the house. This is a beautiful Carlisle home build here at 3 Arwen Court here. Modern family buyers, dream home with four bedrooms, two bathrooms, multiple car spacing opportunities underpinning your prospective purchase of some of the finest real estate that Sandhurst has on offer. Fully renovated with a timeless design, a great lay layout. I love the kitchen, open kitchen and dining area, particularly with multiple living zones. It is so great for entertaining your friends and family and you've even got that shaded outdoor area. I was thinking of doing the auction out there because it really does just showcase what this home is all about and that is up for the taking here for you to take over and move right on in the sooner the better in 30 60 days this could be your brand new home and what a way to end your real estate journey i can tell you there's no better time to do it than right here right now we are expecting rate cuts in the later half of the year that's going to bring even more demand into the marketplace so it pays dividends to get in early this is the perfect time to buy so without further ado i am going to hand it over to you now for your spirited bidding who would like to get the auction underway 750 love to see you in and good luck to you now at 750 now selena's better in the lead and good luck to you let's go in twenty thousand dollar rises on i was going to say 20 but let's go 770 there I, well, actually that is a 20 i'm not even doing my maths properly it's late in the afternoon 770 good luck to you two bidders fighting it out now at 770 let's go 790 otherwise happy to take a 10 just to see you back in quickly at seven hundred and seventy thousand dollars i'd like to see a 790 780.10. We'll take it there at 780 now. What about a 90 from you, Coco? Let me know if your bidder would like to jump back. 795. The bigger bid, bigger bid wins. Let's go another 10 on top. Javid's bid. 800. I'll take the five. Let's keep things moving along. At $800,000 now, back in the lead, Coco, with our second bidder in the race. Coco's bidder in the lead. 
810, bang, that's a bid there. 810 now, I think the, the trend is to go back in fives. Thank you very much for rounding me off to the round numbers there. At 810 now, the bid, Jarvet against you and Coco, your bidder as well. 815? What's with the 15s? I'm happy to take them, but great bidding, by the way. At 815, I love that style. At $815,000, happy to take a 5 or a 15 or a 10, whatever gets you back in. 820, another 5 there. At 820 now, in the lead, and good luck there. At $820,000, going strong. I'm waiting for... 825, jumping down to the fives, which may be good news for you guys there. 825 now, Selena, let me know if you're... 830, too slow there. Coco's bidder in the lead now at $830,000. Javid, what do you say? At 830 now, the bid. Let's go 835, what do you say, guys? At $830,000, Coco's bidder in the lead. Selena, your bidder's... 840, bang, great bid there at $840,000 now. 45, if you will, but at 840000 is that a bid there? 840, seeing... 845, another five there and good luck. At 845,000, good to see you back in the lead now. At 845, Selena, let's get our bidders back in and same to you, Jarvid. At $845,000, any other interest here, you just let me know. Otherwise, my attention is heavily focused this way. At $845,000, need to know in or out what's at 845. 850, great bid. At 850, back in the lead now, Selena. 855, they're ready with it. At 855, you took too long. They had too much time to plan and strategize their next bid. At 855, negative body language over there, which is positive body language in your terms here. Not of the head there, Coco knows it. At 855, sensing that this could be a Javid. Let's get our bidders back in at 855. We may just wrap things up. At 855, now this could be it. Need to know, Selena. Instructions from your bidder and also yours, Jarvid. Need to know now, counting it three times, once, twice, third. 860, back in the lead. Good to see you. At $860,000, can't stand. 865, great bid, straight back at it. At 865, 865, now the bid, what do we say? William, any interest over there? You've been standing there for a long time. Haven't moved away because clearly you sense something there. At 865, you just let me know. At 865, now the bid. Very close, sir. Would you bid if it was? I want to know. Would you bid if it was? We're very close. Very, very close. But if it was, we can take those instructions inside for you. We're so close. At 865, Coco, your bidder in the lead. At 865, three bidders fighting it out here. Any interest, you just let me know, okay? At 865, now the bid, three bidders fighting it out, all out. Need to know, in or out, haven't heard from you guys in a while, just let me know. Are you guys still in it here? Jarvid's still working hard, hasn't walked away yet, sees more. Need to call it three times, otherwise no better bidder offer. We wrap things up once at 865. Twice now at $865,000, third, final time, Zia. Seeing a, com a conversation happening out there. By the way, I didn't introduce Zia before. Zia is also part of the team here, clearly helping out with the rest of the team as well. At 865, let me know if you'd like to jump in. Need to be at 870. Otherwise, any bid on top at this point in time. Coco, I think we may need to take a pause as well if there's not getting, we're not getting the traction here. Give our bidders a little bit more time to strategize. At 865, gonna call it three times and that will signify a time to take a pause. Once, twice, third. Final time, done. Finished, silent. Coco, I think we take a quick pause. We'll seek some instructions from our vendors. We'll give our team a little bit more time to work with our bidders, and we'll be back in just a moment's time.
All righty, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for your patience and anticipation while we sort out some further instructions from our, our vendors here. Now, I am very pleased to let you know that we are very, very close. One last bid could simply unlock that opportunity to put, to put the property on the market and sell to you today. But at this point in time, we are simply going to be passing the property into our highest bidder. So in absence of, the, of further bidding, we're simply going to be passing into Coco's bidder at $865,000. No more vendor bids, no more anything. If where the auction stops we simply wrap things up and this is your final opportunity now at $865,000 don't mind what the increment is another thousand dollars on top could simply do it for you and unlock that opportunity now at $865,000 last chance to the crowd here today and all of our bidders here let me know handing it over to you now once again for your spirited bidding $865,000 firmly in the lead and good luck to you sir it could be yours in just a matter of minutes now at $865,000 last opportunity Javid how's your bidders out here going any bid on top could just unlock that opportunity. Are we all done here? Absolutely sure. You've come all this way. I heard that. I heard just walking inside, you've come a long way for this auction here. Otherwise, it's back to your web portal of choice. You're not going to find another one similar to this. I'm only doing this because this is a beautiful home on the marketplace here. Not much that you can compete with here with the neighborhood and the estate that you're living in here. Selena, same to your buyer as well. With petrol prices the way they are, and we've got more migration coming in, we're only gonna see property prices rise more and more and more. So it pays absolute dividends for you to give that one last push if it means that you purchase the home of your dreams at this point in time. At $865,000, we confirmed absolutely out here, and I'd like to thank you very much for your bidding. All the very best for your real estate journey here. At 865, just waiting on Selena's bid out here. At very, once we're confirmed we're out here, we're done. And by the way, I'd like to thank you very much for your patience while holding the highest bid. I understand that it is a very nerve wracking and stressful position to hold for a while, but I'd absolutely do the same thing for you if I had the pleasure of auctioning your property as well. I'm not convinced that we're out. I think we're 80% of the way there, but we need to make sure absolute certainty that we've done every single last bid. Now, just confirming here one last time because we're having a conversation here. I know that you've told me that you're out. For the record, I don't believe you. I'm paid not to believe you. Now, if the property was on the market, would that change your mind about bidding? We're done at this stage. I would like to thank you very much for your bidding. I appreciate making your way out here and spending your Saturday afternoon here. Selena, one last opportunity before we wrap things up. Once they've said they're out, we're done. At 865, Coco's bidder is waiting. Need to know. Gonna count it three times and that's absolutely it. I think we're at that stage where we need to move the auction along. At 865, calling it three times once. At 866. 866. Now, Coco, I believe that means that we are on the market here. Just confirming there. Need you to say the magic words. But at 866, final instructions from you, please. At $866,000. Let me know. 867, great bidding there. Now, Coco, instructions there at 867. Can we just confirm finally at 867? Now, the bid. Now, it absolutely cost you nothing. That last bid did not do a thing to you because at 867, it means no commitment from you. At $867,000, one last bid could just do it for you as well. At 867, we're having. Coco confirmed the final instructions at this point in time. It makes no sense to back away. But at 867, Coco's bidder in the lead still. At $867,000, any bid on top could get you there. At $867,000, one last opportunity, of course. This is a... This is a monumental decision to make at this point in time. Purchasing real estate is an enormous commitment, and that's why we're giving every single last opportunity for you to jump back in. Now, Selena's moved away and having a chat with another buyer. Javed, let me know if there's any further interest. Otherwise, we need to wrap the auction up at 867,000. Last chance. Calling it three times now, Coco. Need to know the instructions. We're at 867 now. Last opportunity now. At 867, are we or aren't we? Let me know. We are on the market. We are on the market and selling now. No better bidder off are we sell here today, holding the highest bid at this point in time. And good luck to you at $867,000. Make no mistake, untapped, unreserved. We are selling here today at $867,000. That means no late bids or offers. You need to put in your interest right here or right now. You miss out at $867,000. And congratulations to our new owners in advance here. This could be yours. I guarantee you that. 
Once we're done, you will be the buyers at $867,000. One last opportunity. Selena, I need the final confirmation that your bidders are out here. Same with you, Jarvid. Otherwise, we sell away. Any last increment on top could just do it for you. But while we're on the market, I need to give the respect to all of the other buyers that they're absolutely out. While I see too much activity and conversation going on, I cannot wrap up the auction, and I'd do the absolute same for all of you if I had the pleasure of auctioning your very own property as well. At $867,000, I do believe we're done, sir, and I do believe that the property is yours, but in the case that we have one last bit, it's only fair at $867,000 that I call it down now three times, and we're absolutely done. Once at 867,000. Javit, need to know. Twice. 868. Happy to see you back in and made me work for that at 868 now. Need to be at eight, any bigger on top. We're on the market. It'd be remiss of me as the auctioneer to accept, to decline any bid. At 868, 500. 868 and a half. I'm going to say it that way. 868 and a half. We're absolutely sure. They're seeing shake of the heads there, which is great news for you. Holding your composure, and that's really great there. At 868 and a half. 868 and a half. At 868 and a half. What about 869? Round me off another $500. Any bid on top when it comes to the home of your dreams and your future nest egg, this every little bit counts. I've seen bids go trickle between $500, $200. In fact, today, this morning, we just had an, a purchaser purchase on a $50 bid, so I'm not counting anything out at this stage. At 868, 500 in the lead, points to take it away, no better or better offer, we sell. Now, of course, if you are thinking about selling your home by way of auction, of course, get in contact with Coco Ma and the rest of her team. She's more than happy to re recreate this auction magic for you. 870, bang, back in the lead at 870 now. At 1,500 above the last bid. 871, back at him. At 871, great bid, firing straight away. Great to see you fire back immediately at the back end of the auction and put the pressure on your underbidders here. At 871, need to know, any bid on top could see you in. Can't be less than a dollar though, I lied. At 871. At 871, last opportunity, guys. Need to know. Absolutely sure, because we are selling away. Holding off now would only see more and more competition into the marketplace. Your next auction is going to be just as grueling. At 871, they're too happy to be out, so I do need to give them time. I do thank you very much for your patience once again. At 871, I do think it's yours. At 871, last opportunity now. Selena? Gonna give you to the count of three and I need to know. It's only respectful to our highest bidder once at 871 now. Twice at 871, third, final time. We are selling. Five, four, absolutely sure. Three, two.